Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Backyard Bandits. So we couldn't pull off another mission at the end of the month because the Burkut, even though it was back in seven days, it had lost an arm and we needed to update it. So we didn't have enough mechs to get out, pull off that defend base mission. So I decided to just continue working through and getting stuff done for this month. Now I sold off all of the yeah, medium yeah. mech parts that we had and a couple of uh, heavy mech parts that we had in storage. So we were able to make our financial report. So we're okay. Um, the Burkut's back in action. Now we did lose the uh, Sentinel sensors. I do have them on the, uh, I was thinking about pulling them off of the uh, the boar's head here, but I decided to leave them on. And what I ended up doing with the uh, the um, Burkut is out, out lo like loading it out slightly different. It's got a Warfare Suite in it now, uh, which I think is a little better. A pair of medium X pulses. Um, and I just moved the uh, small ER small to this side just to split the X pulses up. So if we lose an arm, we still have one of them left. So the uh, you know, damage output's a little better. Um, the re uh, recon sensors went in here. Um, so that coupled with the warfare suite um, gives us, I think, about the same as the Angel ECM. Now the Angel ECM um, gave us a. Uh, um, electronic countermeasure uh, bonus against five against uh, opponents at a 240 meter range. This only gives us three, uh, or sorry, reduces enemy sensor checked by two within 260. So the Angel was better, but uh, the Warfare Suite gives us a little more variety, I think. So we'll just have to see how that works out. Um, but yeah, so this thing is back up and running. The thing I love about this mech is it's so cheap to get re repaired and back and running again. It was great. Uh, and everything else, well, these guys are all back. As you can see, I removed the uh, um, the bushwhacker here, uh, just so I could get the X pulses out off off of it to put on the uh, Burkut. But we're I, it's highly unlikely we're ever going to use that mech again, so I just removed it for now. So the boar's head. Let's have a look at this guy. So this is our new melee mech, and I, yes, I did go ahead and pull off all of the the individual melee items. So the hatchet. Uh, lower melee battle fist, both retractable blades, and the ER powered ER medium laser, and put them back in one at a time, uh, starting with the damage items first. So this went back in first, then the pirate ER mediums, uh, then the retractable blades, and then the battle fist and the lower melee. So this is all up and running now. We're hitting for uh, where is it here? Is it close range? Uh, melee damage 197 so I don't think that's a hundred percent correct but it's pretty darn close so at 150 percent it's 300 damage per punch so I mean if we can get better melee gear gear sure it'll be it'll be good so um, but we do have the combat shield in here as well minus 14 percent damage taken which is great um, the endo TSM is built into the mech which is good so it's uh, plus 60 percent meter walk distance when active activates above what was it what did it say 23 heat which is pretty good it's better than the regular t uh, endo t or the regular tsms which i think is 25 25 and 27 deactivates below 25 activates above 27 something like that it's pretty close um but we've got four diverse optics medium lasers um which put out 12 heat each variable weapon damage plus it's uh it's got a little bit of extra range on these things and then pirate, the pirate ER medium laser to crank up heat. And then I put in the pirate fire control system, which gives us plus 50, or sorry, plus 10% heat generated. But it's also got plus one accuracy and plus one evasion pips ignored. So hopefully we'll heat up just fine. We also, we've also got an AMS Mark II on here, which I can throw onto overload, which can give us, uh, oh, sorry, it doesn't give us any heat, I don't think. Overload, does overload provide any heat? No, it doesn't. But we've got that. And I did put the hardened armor on this guy. So we got double the armor, which means I'm sh not going to have to worry too much about it, uh, problems with armor. But it does give us minus 20% walking distance. So we'll be sprinting as soon as the TSMs activate, in which case walking might be just as good. because we get a plus 60 meter walk range. But it does have the 400 core in it, so it is relatively fast. And I didn't have a uh, supercharger to drop in it. So we'll just have to see how this works. I don't know. Um, not 100% convinced. Maybe we drop the hardened armor. We'll see for the, uh, where is it here? Uh, internals for the feral lamellar. See how it goes. 
Uh, minus 20% damage would be minus 35% damage taken in total. So might be a better way to go. I don't know yet. We'll see how it goes. Um, but yeah, let's just uh, go back here and that's it. So we're going to go ahead and take a mission today. Now, unfortunately, if we look in the command center, the month lapped around and there's like no missions to take this month. <laughs> I have no idea why all of a sudden the Torians and the Capellans are... Um, have so many missions but the thing is this planet is I think 74% controlled by Oregon Coalition pirate activity is 53% so it's just a luck of the draw we got like no missions to perform here so distraction the both both distraction missions I think are, are viable to take and we'll probably just ride the end of the month out and then we'll see what happens but we'll take distract this first one here four and a half skulls it's against the coalition basically it's a lance on lance battle in the highlands so let's negotiate this we're going to go full savage hopefully we can get some good stuff up well now nah, we'll be fine go full salvage i think we'll make our financial report we only need five hundred thousand or so so as long as we don't get completely shredded in this battle we should be fine but we'll see how it goes so earthquake um okay we need to figure out what we're doing here so let's leave you out Hotshot, you're going to run this one. And we'll leave Queen Bee where she is. Swift can go here. And then let's pull out Focus. And bring him back into here. So the Black Knight with the Goss. Battlemaster, awesome for long range firepower. Burkut for jumping around and having fun. And then we'll bring in the Boar's Head. And do we want mobility over... Let's go fire. This guy can repair himself, so why not? Uh, Earthquake, let's put you in the boar's head because that seems like a, it's like a good name for you. And then let's put Squire. No, let's put uh, Sledge, the Conquistador. Let's go this route. All right, let's do this. Yep, I know. Command interface initiated. Okay, here we go. Oh, this is an interesting position. Looks like a crab, maybe a hunchback, stalker, and something or other. So it might not be too, too bad. Watch the trees. You never know what's in them. Yeah, you think? Um. Quick draw, okay. Oh, there's that Zeus! <gasps> I've got eyes on hostile yeah, they're right behind us too. They're heading your way. Zeus XP rocket carrier. Fuck, that thing's got to die fast. I hear you. We need to murder these guys behind us first. But that's Zeus moved first already, so we can shoot him. Let's grind his ass up. Uh, let's front load this damage. We gotta take these guys down. I was worried when I saw that where we were. Um, I think they probably have two lances down in the main area. We'll get at least one part off that guy, so I'm not worried. We can just shred him fast. Shit. Okay, that's not bad. What is that? Minor damage, Commander. Nothing to see here. Is that the rocket carrier? It couldn't have been the rocket carrier. There's got to be something else back here. Rocket carrier goes on 16, huh? Standing by. You gotta pull a rabbit out of the hat, girl. I'm worried about other guys back here. Let's just do it this way. Copy that. Yep, a light LRM carrier and a striker. Okay. This is bad. Holy shit, it's bad. Got a lock. Okay. 
Hopefully the rocket carrier goes after her. Because that fucking 10 or 11 chevrons of evasion should save her ass. Can we not shoot the rocket carrier? It's just hiding behind there. The more we move, the harder it is to hit with this BSPL, so... I hate the fact that we're turning our backs to those other guys, but... I gotta wipe this... I gotta wipe these guys out. Front load the damage on these guys. Wow, the big one's missed. It's tagged, though. It's gonna help. Hey, buddy. Yeah, none of us are going to get in to get that rocket carrier, unfortunately. Let's get rid of this guy fast. Fuck, all the big ones are missing. Did we not bring any AMS with us? Good to go. He's got AMS. So full, that's a full sprint right there. I copy. All right. I was thinking about continuing to move ahead because it's going to take a while to get over there. But I think we want to come over here, warm ourselves up a little bit, and bring the AMS to bear on the enemy. On Good shooting, man. I think that's going to save us a lot from these rockets. Yeah, not that much. Look at this. I think he's spent now, though. No, he's not. I'm on the move. I'm on the move. Full speed. Good chances to hit. Front load it. Let's go after this guy. Second. I was really hoping he was going to go after the Burkut, but, you know, I understand why he didn't. Oh, fuck me. I lost the weapon. Okay, that hurt. I'm under heavy fire. They're getting the angle on me. Well, the missions are getting harder. I think we really need eight guys down here. Just saying. Waiting for orders. On my way. <sighs> Burn this guy. We're going right to the side of this guy. He's out of range of the Atlas, unfortunately. Yes, Commander. Enemy outflanked, bringing the pain. Not enough to kill, huh? Well, that's all right. We'll go. That's all right. We'll deal with it. They're flanking. Damage minimal. 
Ready for orders. Full speed, no target. Let's give this guy a fuck you. There you go. Target eliminated. All right, now we can turn. We lost a large BSPL off this guy, medium extra star. Well, you know, I was never a uh, hundred percent happy with the loadout anyway, so. Wait, what? I can't go that way? You can't... Huh? That's not a... The option, you can't actually go that way? Fuck's sake. Roger that. That's so bad. Locked on target. I think if we're going to do a melee mech again, it's got to be like a Black Knight. Got to have it 75 tons. Got to have it with like a full engine, like a full core, and just massive range on it to sprint in and do damage. Because these heavy mechs, well, they can do a lot of damage. On these larger map boards, they're just not, they just can't cut it. Waiting for orders. So your left side is intact. Move over here. You're pretty much done for the battle. I think that Zeus had to, has a snub nose heavy gas. I'm pretty sure it does. Good to go. All right, let's get on these guys and get this done and get out of here. All weapons are go. Enjoy the heat, buddy. Enjoy the heat. Kind of a good combination. Sensor lock and ballistic. Minimal damage, Commander. We'll deal with these guys in a second here. Gonna let the Burkut do the work on these guys, I think. Or the conquistador, maybe I'll go up there and deal a death blow on those two. I think the, I think the Burkut will go in and kill the uh, LRM carrier. Alrighty. Commander. I think you're gonna get into battle faster this no way. Just running. You know, other than the uh, armor repair systems on the Conquistador, there's not much I'm liking about it. Yes, Commander. Of course, I haven't given... I have like, uh, I will say yes, I haven't given it much of a chance yet. Wait, uh, left side to the enemy? Left side to the enemy. On my way. Affirmative. Yeah. Gotta try it. That's a miss. Gotta try it. Yes, Commander. And here's where we lose all our heat. Got it.
All right, well, at least we're hitting with shit. <sighs> Caught between a rock and a hard place. Okay, let's get up here. See if we can finish this guy up. If not, we'll leave him a nice barrage. Beautiful. Reporting vehicle destroyed. All right, focus. On the move, full speed. Get this freaking battle master into the battle. Work on this guy first. We've damaged him enough. God, this mech. Against lighter targets, all the all of our guys do well. Against the heavier targets, not so much. Coordinates received. Yeah, we'll be going in the water in a second. Uh, yeah, fuck him. Oof, see ya. Enemy down. Okay. Let's clean this up and go home. Already taken enough damage. I don't think I have a large VSPL to replace that other one with. So I gotta think of a new loadout. Uh, we gotta get a barrage here. We need to get out of barrage range. Got a little bit of stealth on this guy. Not much, but a little bit. Yeah, we're overheating already. Uh, we're gonna take it. Beautiful. Enemy vehicle destroyed. I think it's a harder hitter, but we're, we're it, it uses a lot more heat though. Let's be very wary of that, I think. Come on, Board's Head's got to punch something. Before this series ends. The hell? Oh, that's what? That's the catapult? Yeah. Minor damage, Commander. Yep, catapult. Standing by. Let's move over here and brace, buddy. Just brace it up. Standing by. Yeah, we're still at zero percent. Okay. Thirty-seven. Not enough. There we go. Quick draw, 56%. Here it comes. I copy. Oof. Good shooting, man. Goes the arm. Scored a critical hit. Order. Aye, aye. Full sprinting. See ya. Firing a full salvo. Well, not quite enough, but good damage. Even with those low percentage chance to hit, he does Commander. pretty good. God, look how fucking slow. Oh, well, TSMs aren't on, but still, like... This thing's a juggernaut, but it's useless. Fucking useless juggernaut. I think I hit something good. Just these three guys left, it looks like.
that, that atlas won't even make it in. The atlas will not even make it into battle. Waiting for orders. Roger. Full speed. Well, let's see if we can hit that. Uh, nah, he's pretty well hidden over here. That's a kill. That's a murder death kill right there. Let's take the murder death kill. Here it comes. There it is, folks. That's a kill. That's a murder death kill is what that is. Waiting for orders. Um gonna stand here and get our stability back and fire at this guy. Well, looks like he's got the advanced uh standing by. What's it called? You know you know what I'm talking about, that advanced thing. Understood. Moving fast. Advanced prototype double heat sink kit that uh drops the heat once it passes a certain level. Got it. Ooh, did our, uh, yeah, our, our uh, boy said took took care of that for Roger. us. Engaging jump jets. Let's drop our heat. We're going to get in on that uh, catapult in a second to get some uh, sensors on them and Get some ECCM going, I think, this time. Yes, command. If he's not already dead by then. Okay. I'm on it. Let's get our stability back by standing in an unstable terrain. Oh fuck. Alright, let's finish this up fast. Maybe we can pull off that second mission. That'd be nice to be able to do two of these. Visual sighting. Visual sighting confirmed. 43, huh? Well, let's take the kill. Not gonna bail out. Critical hit, Commander. Commander? Well, he's tough. I'll give him that. Wish this guy was a little faster. Oops. Yeah, sorry about that, buddy. Losing lots of armor. Yep. Keep moving forward, buddy. Awaiting orders. How you like me now? Rear armor it is. Ooh. Good damage. Good to go. No you're not. You stay right there. Holding. As long as I can't see you, you stay right there. I guess it's not a bad movement speed for the Battlemaster. I guess? I don't know. Inflicted some heavy damage. Okay, TSM's on. You 
Okay, God. finish up that crab. All weapons are broken. See ya. Spangled down. Well, let's see what he's doing. Alright, I want to see what this battle master can hit for. Good to go. Not quite there yet. Let's move. Okay, I don't want this guy to die, so I'm going to go ahead and engaging with target. Okay. Receiving you. Good to go. Ready for orders. Well, we might actually get to kill somebody. I'm not gonna ping him or anything. Prepping for jump. We'll come back over here, and then if we don't kill him with the melee mech. Receiving you. All right, let's see what we do here. AMS is grinding that down, eh? Did we get any of them? 15 from 77? Oh, it's not bad, I guess. There we go. Ready for orders. Okay, I'm gonna punch him right from the front. 91% chance to hit, 269 damage, so it's not as much as I thought it would be. Location confirmed. Still a kill though. Eliminated. Yeah, I guess it's okay. Alright, now when I say I guess it's okay, what I actually mean is... If you think about it, that mech would have been dead if everybody had fired at it. Or the turn before, and if that 100 ton mech was sporting heavier weapons, it would have been dead long before. So the fact that it had to, we had to wait for it to get in there to kill something. Okay, it's not okay, but in a way, if that was in a, if this is mech was in the city streets and it was able to maneuver and get in close to where the, all the enemies were, it could shred people fast. So I don't know, it's really situational, I think. All right. So, nothing really major here. Conquistador lost its arm, but not much we can do about that. That Zeus was a monster. Alright, where's that Zeus part, man? Just need one. Just need one. ATM-12 pirate. What else do we got down here? Got a large VSPL? Anything? Large VSPL? Probably not. Come on. Prototype double heat sinks. I'm going to drop that in there for now. That's it. Yeah. Garbage. Garbage. Yeah. Well. Okay. We're going to go this route. Alright, we've got a quick draw apart. A pair of ER mediums, which we'll hang on to. Might need them. Heavy rocket launcher 20s. Pair of MRM 40s. That's crazy. Chameleon LPS. We've already got one. We're not even using it right now. So let's just sell that because we're gonna we need the C bill. Standard fusion core can go. This can go. Alright, so not bad. We made it okay. Uh 484. Wow. Yeah, well, we lost the arm, so that's why. Okay, let's get stuff up here. Conquistador is only going to be... Well, then we have to re-outfit -out it, right? So the Battlemaster can come right up. Black Knight can come right up. 
Uh, let's get the boar's head fixed and out of the way with. The victor can come right up. Actually, let's put that in first. So in five days, we can have four mechs back. Uh, Conquistador is going to need a bit of work. Okay, let's close that. Yeah, uh, when is the financial report again? 18 days, so it's not bad. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to end this episode. Um, I'm rolling around a few ideas in my head. I think probably between episodes I'm going to execute them. I'm thinking that what's, what's really killing us is trying to run two lances. We just don't have the sea bills to continue doing this. It's just not going to happen and be successful. So because we've got mechs that we can't even get back yet because it's taking so long for them to get fixed, right? So i got to think about what mechs I want to keep in my lineup and I'm going to flush some of, them out, some of them out. Like the Warhammer 2C I want back and I think I'm going to strip the Awesome and get rid of the Awesome. The Conquistador for now might go into storage. I'm not 100% sold on it. Maybe it will, maybe it won't. I don't know yet. Um, I want to keep the Vulture in the Lance. The, the Blackhawk's going to go into storage. Um, depending on how, what the cost is to fix the mule near, I might just go ahead and do that and put that in storage. I want to get an artillery mech going. I'm wondering at this point in the series if it's just better to scrap that second atlas. Because getting it outfitted and into the lineup is just going to be way cost prohibitive right at this moment. I should focus on what I have, not what I need. Or what I'd like, was what I'm saying. And then get the, uh, get an artillery mech up and running. And then we can expand our drop capability and go with two lances in one shot. I think that might be the best way to go. Well, let me think about it. I'm going to work on it between episodes. When I come back next time, we'll take that other mission um, and see how it goes. That'll be a five sculler. So, okay, I end this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. Also, drop any comments in the comment section down below. I love hearing the comments. Until next time, we'll see you later.